Understanding guys, part 13. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Ladies, we do this. We try to make them jealous. We want to see how they react, but it annoys them and it's just going to push them away. If you guys are in an argument and the dude is quiet, don't think that they don't care. Guys act on logic, not on emotion. He's quiet because he's thinking. Let him think. When you hug him, lay your head on his chest. Adorable. If the game is on, if they're playing video games, whatever it is, either join them or leave them alone. <laughs> if he is watching a game or in the middle of a game, do not interrupt it. That is his time. And lastly, guys, I'm sorry. But right after a breakup, or if the dude is hurt, they are so good at being okay at first. But the truth is, it takes them so long to get over it. A man with a broken heart takes time to heal. Because when they love someone, they love someone. Understanding guys, part 14. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Not every guy wants to have sex with every girl they see. And when us ladies say that and assume that, it gets to them. Not cool. Ladies, don't say, I'm fine, when you're not. It's annoying for the guy to have to dig and pry and ask and beg for you to tell them what's wrong. Just tell them. When we take too long to get ready, they get annoyed. When you guys are getting something to eat, and us ladies either say we're not hungry or we order something small thinking that we're not going to eat that much, and then we start picking at the guy's food. Listen, I'm sure the guys don't mind sharing, but in their head, they're like, damn. And when a dude likes someone, and I mean likes someone, infatuated, it's a crush, they care and they overthink so much. If they send you a smiley face and you send them words with periods, they get concerned. They start overthinking. It's not just ladies, guys do it too. Understanding guys, part 15. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Ladies, we gotta stop asking these dudes questions that have no right answer. Example, am I fat? Is that girl cute? Don't do it. When our hair smells nice. Ladies, take your hand, put it on his thigh. Guys go crazy. Their heart is playing hopscotch in their chest. If you notice that your dude has had a long day, offer him a massage. You're welcome. And lastly, I already know this one's gonna be very controversial. Give me a chance. Hear me out. Ladies, yes, if you got a banging body, a dude is gonna notice. But it's not gonna keep him. Hold on. Agree to disagree, but when a man loves you, a man. Ladies, the way our body looks, our insecurities, the flaws that we see, these dudes do not care. Abs, no abs, small waist, thick thighs, thigh gap. They love you for you. On God. Understanding guys, part 16. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Yes, guys do not mind reassuring you, telling you that you're beautiful, that you're worthy, but doing it all the time can be draining for them too. At the end of the day, confidence is so attractive. Ladies, if they do not give you the password to their cell phone, let's not assume the worst. If someone is hitting on your man, don't be mad at him. Depends on the situation. However, show some pride. Be like, yes, that is my man. He looks mine. Guys love it when you show that you're proud to have him. Lastly, believe it or not, guys can be really insecure. They're scared to not be enough for you, for their family, for themselves. Their goal is to be someone you are proud of, to be worthy, to be enough. Ladies, let's remind them that they are. Understanding guys, part 17. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Clingy is not cute. Ladies, it's nice to know that you want to be with him and hang out with him and talk to him, but find that balance with space. Otherwise, he'll just get annoyed. He has a life outside of you too, and you have a life outside of him. Remember that. Why do guys like to say that they're heartless? Self-proclaiming that they don't care about anything and or have feelings? It's because they've been hurt, heartbroken. A man is never the same after they are heartbroken for the first time ever. Ladies, I understand you want to be a bad bitch, but there's a difference between being a bad bitch and just being straight up rude. Guys do not find mean girls attractive. Ooh, 
Guys, you're gonna hate me for this. I'm already on part 17. Y'all hate me, I know. If he loves you, he is so good at putting you before him. If someone else makes you happy, he will dip. Act like he doesn't care because he doesn't want you to know that you hurt him. Get in the way of your happiness. They care. Understanding guys, part 18. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Gentlemen, I know you guys are smooth with your talking, but when it comes to talking to a girl that you actually really like, you just don't know what to say, do you? <laughs> But let's applaud them for trying. Ladies, have you ever noticed that if a guy needs help with like relationship advice or just with another girl, they never go to their guy friends? This is because if a guy doesn't know what to do, he doesn't think that his guy friends are gonna know what to do either. So if a guy is coming to you for advice, take it seriously, help him out. No matter how much a guy really likes a girl, if you tell him he's whipped, it hurts them. But us ladies need to not get mad when he gets upset that someone calls him whipped. Lastly, I'm gonna be real with you guys. Believe it or not, guys are really sensitive when it comes to their bodies. It's the same thing, because girls hate it too. Don't say that we're like chunky or chubby. But guys absolutely hate it when you tell them that they're skinny. Agree to disagree, but let me know. Understanding guys, part 19. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. If he talks about a future with you, yo, he's in love, love. That is serious right there. I've said this before, guys are very protective. But honestly, it does not matter how much he likes you or loves you because if you disrespect his family, you are done crossing the line. Send him full face pictures. Ooh! Love. Late night conversations. They are the best kind of conversations. Guys love them. Ladies, if we ask him to do something, but you hit them with the, nah, it's okay, you don't, you don't have to. Blackmail. Now the guy feels like they really have to. Guys. What happens in the guy's locker room stays in the guy's locker room. They're never gonna tell us ladies. And lastly, a dude can go about his day checking out females, whatever. But the first person on his mind in the morning and the last person before he goes to bed, that's the person that matters. Understanding guys, part 20. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Yo, we're on part 20. How much is too much? I don't know, but guys, let me know if I'm wrong. Listen, guys, do not mess with drama, especially if the drama has nothing to do with him. So ladies, if we got a problem with another female, leave the mans out of it. Ladies, if you are wondering if he's hurting, so you stalk him on social media, he's not gonna post anything. Don't even try. It's not what they do. I just have to say it. A guy's friend group, they are so down for each other. Most of the time, they don't have any problems. They just vibe. That's why you don't mess with the boys. You're gonna know if a dude likes you. If you tease him, he just brushes it off. He's not interested. But if you tease him and he does the whole, shut up, and then teases you back, he likes you. And lastly, women forgive but never forget, and men forget but never forgive. You hurt him, it's done. Understanding guys part 21. Hi. Hello. It's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. How much is too much? I don't know, but we're gonna keep going with it. Ladies, when a dude likes you and you call him bro or dude, that hurts. When y'all are FaceTiming, ladies, show your face. That is the whole point. Guys get so proud of themselves when they can make us ladies laugh. I've said it before, but y'all ladies need to be more straightforward with our guys even if it's bad. So even if you're not interested anymore, at least tell him the truth and he'll respect it. He'd rather have that than being led on and just randomly ghosted. Listen, the boys are never going to leave. So yes, get along with them, get to know them. Do that for your mans, but know your boundaries. Don't get too friendly with them because your mans can still get jealous. It's still a thing. And lastly, yes, baby girl play some hard to get, but remember the guys can't read between the lines, so don't play too hard to get. It might just push him away. Understanding guys, part 22. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, if I say anything wrong, please let me know. Guys hate being left on red. Ladies hate it too, but believe it or not, guys don't like it either. Never argue in public. Guys don't like the drama, they don't like making the scene. If y'all need to talk, talk in private. Ladies, believe it or not, if a dude likes you, they do not see your flaws as flaws. They will think that you are absolutely perfect. You can love him all you want, but if you do not respect him, if you belittle him in any way, that hurts a lot. 
don't do it. We always wonder why the guy's restroom has no line. Because guys don't talk in the restroom. Listen, the bromance between him and his boys, that is an everlasting love. Nothing compares to the bromance. Do not question it. If a dude chooses the female over the boys, you better check your mans. Be a good girlfriend, future girlfriend. Respect the boy. Understanding guys, part 23. Hi, hello, it's Anne. We're on part 23. I haven't posted one of these in a really long time. So guys, if I'm wrong, please let me know. Video games are not just video games. It's bonding with the boys. That is his time with the boys while not being with the boys. Also time that we need to respect. Listen, it doesn't matter how much a guy likes you. If you are dry, if you don't reciprocate the same energy, they will give up. Ladies, sometimes too hard to get is too much. Do not ask him to rate your friends. Don't do it. Ladies, if you and this guy, like, you guys just don't work out. His friends are off limits. Ladies, gentlemen, if you are the guy best friend, I'm about to expose you. I'm sorry. Yes, guys and girls can just be friends, but the chances of him actually being in love with you is really high. Chances are he's waiting for you to make the first move. He's loved you from the beginning. 